at 10 o'clock tonight, payment problems. Thousands of Champion Energy customers impacted by a billing glitch that has hit their wallets. Those customers now out hard-earned cash and they're waiting to get some refunds. KPRC 2's Michael Lapardi live in North Houston with more on this. And Michael, what is Champion Energy saying tonight? Well, Dominique, the folks back there at Champion say there was a problem, but that problem has since been fixed. Still, a customer told me he panicked when he opened up his account and saw this. The payment listed not once, but twice. Daniel Martinez got an unwelcome surprise. I woke up yesterday morning and noticed that my bank account was overdrawn. A few days after paying $152.20 towards his electric bill, he says Champion Energy deducted the payment from his checking account not once, but twice this week. I am not a rich man. I, I don't have hundreds and hundreds and thousands of dollars in my account. So if I get one, if I pay my electric bill, I only expect it to be charged once. And for a guy who's currently unemployed, the $34 overdraft fee didn't help. I never overdraw my account. I, like I said, I watch my money. Champion Energy told us a software transition issue caused payments to be processed more than once for roughly 8,800 customers. The company says it since notified the people who were impacted, reversed the charges, and fixed the problem. Champion said in a statement, quote, we will be giving all impacted customers a $30 credit on their next invoice for their inconvenience. We pride ourselves in our customer service and we sincerely apologize for this situation. It's broken trust. It's broken loyalty. I've been with Champion for seven years. I've never been late. I pay my bills on time. Now he's waiting on part of that payment to be returned. Daniel's account also has a third transaction from Champion that's currently pending, but he's not sure if that's a credit or another charge. Champion told us that most of the customers that were impacted are using auto pay, but not everyone. Reporting live tonight, Michael Lopardi, KPRC 2 News. Michael, thank you.